Okay, okay, so there's this one secret that I've discovered that you could do today to make you more successful than ever before. And I wanna tell you exactly what it is. You see, I've spent 10 years of my life educating myself, learning, going to training courses, paid and for free. Uh, I've read endless numbers of books. I've listened to podcasts, looked at YouTube videos. I've done it all. I've scoured the earth and I've come across this one secret that completely changed everything for me over the last 18 months. And I'll tell you exactly what that is right now. Okay, and here it is. The one thing you need to do is educate yourself and then take action. And you might be asking me, well, Jack, what do you mean by take action? I mean, there's so many people out there right now talking about what they want to be doing. And they're maybe going to these seminars and these training sessions and, and watching YouTube videos and thinking, oh, do you know what? I just, I just want to, I know what I want to do. I know where I want to be but nobody's actually acting on it. There's probably about 0.5% of people that actually learn the knowledge and then actually apply and take action on that. And it's those people that see results. And it's crazy because we live in an age where it's so easy to get educated. And I'll probably talk about that in another day, but there's so many different areas in which you can educate yourself. And there's a lot of people that actually are doing that. And yet they're still not seeing results. And that's because they haven't taken action yet. And you might be thinking, okay, Jack, fine, I get what you mean, take action, I need to take action, but how does that actually work? What am I meant to do? How am I meant to do that? Okay, and there's there's so many different things that can get in the way of you taking action, and there's loads of things that got in the way of me taking action, but there was two things in particular that I want to talk about in this video. The first one is stop comparing. Comparison kills, and so many people uh, are comparing themselves to people who've been in the business, in the industry that they want to be in for years and years. But that's the whole point. Those people have been in it for years and years, and so their quality of content is probably going to be a little bit better because they've actually started. Everybody started from somewhere, and so don't compare your journey to somebody who's been on the journey for five, ten years more than you. There's no point doing that because it's not gonna add up. If they've been working way longer than you have, then of course they're gonna have better results. And that's something that I've been doing the past 10 years. I've been educating, coming up with loads of new innovative ideas and wanting to educate myself about them and then realizing I haven't actually seen any results yet. That's because I hadn't taken action. I was too busy comparing myself thinking, well, I can't do this because that person does it way better than me. The thing is, guys, you've got to run your own race. Focus on what you're doing and then just take action. Get tunnel vision. Stop looking to the right. Stop looking to the left. Stop getting distracted by the people around you and comparing yourself to what they do. You need to start taking action today. How do you know if you are struggling with comparison? Well, have you ever been on a diet and maybe thought, well, that person down the road, they look well better than me and I've been on this diet for two weeks now and I don't look that good you struggle with comparison. Have you ever started a business and thought, well, you know, this person down the road is doing a much better job than me because they've been doing it for an extra five years and, you know, they've really got the staff. I've not got the same staff that they have and blah, 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 blah. You struggle with comparison. Have you ever got a grade at school and been actually pretty happy with it until you discovered what your friend got and then you were pretty gutted with the score and grade that you got? you struggle with comparison. And if you find yourself in any of those situations or something similar where you find yourself comparing yourself to somebody, you struggle with comparison and it needs to stop. Even if that means unfollowing some people on social media or hanging out a little bit less with people that make you feel inadequate, it's worth it because you have to run your race, you have to do what you need to do, take action to succeed. And if comparison's getting in the way, get rid of it. The second step to help you take action is what I call redefining the win. And this slightly links to comparison because you might compare yourself to somebody who's five years down the line and you might think, well, I'm not being as successful as they are. I'm not as, as good as they are. I'm not winning in the same way that they are. But the thing is, guys, you need to stop comparing yourself to the people around you. You need to redefine how you view the win. If you started in the last year and you're not making five, six, seven figures, like the person down the road. Is that a failure? No, it isn't. And if you think that it is, then it will just slow you down and stop you from taking action. 
That's what happened to me. I took ages just to stop thinking, oh, you know, this person is so successful. They're doing such a great job. And, and, and you know, my success doesn't look like their success. But I had to completely shift that on its head and turn it on its head. And the way that I shifted this perspective was I asked myself, what does it mean for me to win today? Yes, everybody has goals, everyone has vision and dreams and things that they want to achieve and they want to get to a certain place. But what can I do today? Me, not, not Joe Bloggs down the road who is also running a similar business. Me, how do I today win? What does that mean for me to win? Well, it could be that I'd make an extra five sales calls and do they have to convert? No, the fact that I did an extra five, that's a win because I took a next step. The way you need to view the win is actually, it's not success. Success doesn't mean you've made it. It means you've progressed closer to your goal. If you struggle with something like this, I really recommend reading the book, The Compound Effect. It's a fantastic book that I read uh, sometime last year. And it's ju it just talks about small differences that compound to make a big impact. So if you wanna try and lose weight, rather than just going, okay, I'm gonna cut out everything in my diet and just eat lettuce and chicken, then that's gonna just make you crash because it's such a big change. But if you make small changes, if you go out for a walk, or if you run an extra mile each day, then it just means that you'll do small things every single day that can compound and have a massive difference. And it's people that do that and live their lives that way that compound these small things that have a huge impact. The reason why is because they are doing small things and so it's actually very manageable today. They view it as a win, they've conquered something, and because they keep on doing it, it amounts to something absolutely massive. Like I said, the last 10 years, I haven't really taken any action. And it's meant, as you can imagine, that I haven't really got many results. But the last 18 months, I've started to take action on what I've been learning and how uh, I've been educating myself. And it's completely transformed the way that I view success. It's completely transformed the way that I look at life, really. And I've realised to win is to just make progress every single day. Small things every day that progress me closer to my long-term goal. It can be a small thing, it's still a win. You need to redefine the win for you. And so as part of me progressing and taking small steps to win, what I wanted to do is document the things that I'm learning and the things that I'm doing over the next however long I can. Uh, and just wanna teach uh, everything that I'm learning to you guys, uh, teach the lessons that I've learned, and also take you along to show the action that I'm actually taking. If you found this helpful, I'm gonna be doing loads of content similar to this. So make sure that you subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you can get notified when I make a video. Um, it'd be fantastic to have you along in the journey and to uh, just see how you're getting on, to see how you're finding this uh, journey of learning to win and really progress towards the goals that we have.